hello everyone in this video we are going to discuss about the few definitions now the first definition scalar function a scalar function is a function that assigns a real number that is scalar to a set of real variables its general form is u equal to u of x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn where x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn are real numbers now the next definition vector function a vector function is a function that assigns a vector to a set of real variables its general form is capital f is equal to f1 of x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn of i plus f2 of x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn of j plus f3 of x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn of k are equivalently now this capital f is equal to this we can denote it by a column matrix that is f1 f2 f3 which is equal to f1 of x1 comma x2 comma so on xn f2 of x1 comma x2 comma so on xn f3 of x1 comma x2 comma so on xn where x1 comma x2 comma so on comma xn are real numbers now the next definition point function a point function u equal to f of p is a function that assigns some number or value u to each point p of some region capital r of space examples of point functions are scalar point functions and vector point functions now here you can see the definition of scalar point function scalar point function a scalar point function is a function that assigns a real number that is a scalar to each point of some region of space if to each point of x comma y comma z of a region capital r in space there is assigned a real number u equal to pi of x comma y comma z then pi is called a scalar point function now the examples first one the temperature distribution within some body at a a particular point in time second example the density distribution within some fluid at a particular point in time particular point in time now the next definition vector point function a vector point function is a function that assigns a vector to each point of some region of space if to each point of x comma y comma z of a region capital r in space there is assigned a vector capital f is equal to capital f of x comma y comma z then capital f is called a vector point function such a function would have a representation capital f is equal to f1 of x comma y comma z of i plus f2 of x comma y comma z into j plus f3 of x comma y comma z into k r equivalently now capital f is equal to 
this we are denoting by row matrix that is so sorry this is a column matrix f1 f2 f3 and which is equal to this is also a column matrix f1 of x comma y comma z f2 of x comma y comma z f3 of x comma y comma z i hope you like this video for more videos please do subscribe my channel until then keep watching bye bye